Good afternoon and welcome to another edition of Be Dad's Beer Reviews. Out in the greenhouse of games again, another nice sunny day, so I'll get outside and do some outdoor reviews. Gonna do my four from one Saturday, and uh, this weekend we are gonna be doing Rivington, uh, the Rivington Brewing Company. I've never had a Rivington beer before, they've popped up in Barton's, so I've managed to pick up four. And this is the first one, and it is soon I'll be on fries. And this is a porter with blackberries, blackcurrant, raspberries and vanilla. And this weighs in at 5.5%. This cost me £4 out of Barton's and Um Let's see if I can find the best before in this one. Best before, yeah, best before the 29th of October, 21. It says that in little writing. There. So, I've heard good things about Rivington. So let's find out, let's pop it off. Let's see what we've got. A porter with blackberries, blackcurrant, raspberries and vanilla. Interesting. Put the rest of the count in the by the glass shortly. So being a glass, what have we got? We've got ourselves a very murky brown coloured beer, almost black. We've got a finger and a half of densely compact white head. Well, say white, densely compact um, ivory head. There's a little bit of carbonation clinging to the bottom of the glass down there and to the sides here. But it looks lovely. It looks lovely. Right, let's get a nose so we can smell. Let's go for it. Roasted malt, bit of chocolate. You do. I can smell the the black uh, the blackberries. I can smell the fruit that's in it. it smells quite nice. Let's go for the body and carb. Cheers. Light, light bodied, almost watery. I um, carbonation is light or well, medium right, it's got a big taste cheers <laughs> it's got a light tart background you get roasted, you get the roasted malt. Then you get this, so you get this really delicate uh, fruit tartiness. <coughs> um, then it washes itself away, it doesn't leave much lingering around. It's like a rim. It's like a Coca Cola ish sort of feel to it. The little bit of hit, little bit of sweetness. You, you do get the fruit. You do get the blackberries and the black currants. Get the raspberries towards the end. So I said it on the side. So it's a porter with the additions of blackberries, black currants, uh, raspberries, and a touch of vanilla. Uh, to assume that they're proper. The proper fruits, I would assume. It's refreshing. It's okay. It's not great. It's not bad. I've got another one there in the house. I was given given a can of it by uh, by Ben the beer lad. Uh, check out his channel. Very drinkable. It's nothing special for me. You get a big mouthful, you do kind of pick up the light again, light bit of chocolate. But it's it's okay. It's, it's okay. It's not fantastic. It's no whale beater, but it's it's all right. Is it worth the four pounds? They're paid for it. 
No, it's not. Just lacking something. But there you go. Anyway, I've wrapped this review up. So, Rivington Brew Co. Well, Rivington Brew Co. Um, soon I'll be on fries with porter, with blackberries, blackcurrants, raspberries, and vanilla. 5.5%. Do I like it? It's okay. Would I buy it again? No. Would I recommend it to friends? No. It's, I find out that porters and stouts that are at this sort of ABV just don't do it. It's just too too light in the body. Um, and also, they, they do lack a little bit of flavour. Um, but there, there you go. So, anyway, um, if you've had this beer, let me know what you think. Please put a little comment in the comments box below. I will link the Rivington um, website also below. Give me a thumbs up at the video, thumbs down if you don't subscribe down there. I'll be back again for another one for the second Rivington beer. And I'll see you later. Stay safe, enjoy the weather. Hey, the end.